For people who are financially unable to get legal aid, the Charleston Pro Bono Legal Services steps in to help. And coming up in just a few weeks, they'll be holding their Jammin' for Justice fundraiser. Joining today to tell us a little bit more about what Jammin' for Justice is all about, we have our guest, Sean Kiefer, the event host, and Sydney Ford, the Director of Development for Charleston Pro Bono Legal Service. Thank you both for being here with us today. Thank you for having us. Thank you for having us. We want to talk about the event, but we want to start off by talking about the pro bono legal services. Pro bono is free. Uh, what are the requirements to be able to use those services? So one thing most people don't know is when you have a criminal charge and you're low income, you're appointed a public defender. When you have a civil legal aid case, you don't get that same requirement. So people who are above the federal poverty level um, apply through our office for a number of civil legal aid cases, family law, survivors of human trafficking, eviction prevention. We really step in to fill that justice gap for people who might not be able to afford an attorney and otherwise would be out of luck. All right, and this uh, event that we're having, Jammin' for Justice, is to raise money for those services. You're going to be the host. I'm going to be the host, right? Tell us about the program. What can we expect? So I, um, I've known the folks over at Pro Bono Legal Services for, for some time, and a year ago, this is our second annual Jammin' for Justice, and a year ago, I said, why don't we host a singer-songwriter in the round fundraiser? And I was able, through some connections that I had developed in the music community, I'm also a musician, I was able to get some incredible musicians. There's a musician from Georgia, his name's Levi Lowry. He is a principal songwriter for Zach Brown. He writes songs for Darius Rucker, Blackberry Smoke. He's going to come and perform as well. There is a local musician, his name is Warwick Music. Ironically, Warwick and I grew up in the same little hometown, mm. Laura, South Carolina. Warwick is just coming off an appearance at the Carolina Country Music Festival. And then over the last year, I met a duo from Columbia called Admiral Radio. And they have just been sweeping across the Southeast, winning singer songwriter awards and events all over the place and these guys are going to really take off so it's going to be a night of original music stories songs based on a kind of nashville singer songwriter setup so is this you said nashville is it a country music setting or it does it expand over several genres so i'm going to say it covers over several genres I've been all of my life trying to escape from my heavy metal upbringing and it's straight <laughs> over into country and Americana. Admiral Radio is an Americana act. Levi Lowry, probably country Americana, and Warwick is just as great a country musician as you're going to find. So this is to raise funds. How much are the tickets to get in? So we've got... We have our general admission tickets that are $50, but we do have a few VIP levels left for $75. Those people will get a chance to meet and greet with the artists, get some swag for Jammin' for Justice, and get front row seats for the event. So get a little bit extra benefits with that package. All right, so to learn more about the pro bono legal services and to learn more about Jammin' for Justice, you can go over to our website, live5news.com. Look under the big red box and the information is there for you. Thank you both for being here with us. We'll be right back.